Hello everyone, welcome to another video. And for today, we are all about sexy perfumes. Um, as I was going through my collection, um, I was thinking, what is sexy? Because for me personally, sexy is not just your like textbook definition or your cliche definition of like a girl in scanty clothing or like very sexy going to bars or going to parties because sexy can mean a lot of different things for a lot of different people. So I have this idea of having like five sexy scenarios or five scenes in my head and I would pair them with five perfumes that are in my collection. So if you guys want to know what these five sexy scenes and five sexy fragrances, then keep on watching. So for the first perfume or scene, this is a very tropical, sexy vibe. So just imagine you're on the beach, just choose your favorite beach, choose your favorite like um, tropical area. So you're on the beach, it's nighttime, you're so tired after a whole day of activities and you just had a great bubble bath with bath bombs and candles and you had a little bit of wine and you decide to dress up just in a very simple floral dress. Just imagine like an off shoulder dress with a very high slit and um, you just have your hair up in a high ponytail like this one or like in a messy bun and then you put a little flower in there you know just feeling yourself and then you go to the bar have yourself some exotic food like desserts or whatever and have your drinks and then the music comes on and then you decide to go to the dance floor dance and then somebody comes near you and uh oh yes so that's the kind of image that i have with this one for the first perfume very tropical very sensual but carefree and just young and vibrant and just full of life so the first perfume is rebel fleur by rihanna so this has your delicious peach coconut and plum in here and tuberose the coconut in here is just delicious and then you have your plum and your peach that i think with all together would blend really well when you're like in a tropical area and the beach and you're sweating and you're dancing and you're just enjoying life. You have your drink in one hand and just your hair messy. This is the one. So that's the kind of sexy for this perfume. I love this one. I spray this a lot. I use this a lot. And yes, I guess that's my kind of like tropical, sexy, sweaty kind of fragrance. Second sexy fragrance that I have is a young, juvenile but not innocent kind of sexy fragrance this i would imagine someone in their mid 20s to early 20s and this is like your secret sexy kind of fragrance like you don't dress super sexy but you know you are sexy like in a secret kind of way for this one the scene that i have in my mind is like someone maybe in college and i just imagine like a library if you guys have seen like the gone girl movie like in that library scene. This is the one that I am kind of imagining for this one. So we're just going to keep it kids friendly in here. So maybe that's someone in that kind of vibe. Like I'm sexy, but I'm not like overdoing it. Somehow I'm also imagining like Megan Fox. And I know a lot of people love Megan Fox, but I'm imagining someone like Megan Fox in Transformers. I know she was super sexualized in that movie where she had to wear these like really, really short clothes. But somewhere in that kind of like vibe like her in transformers or also in jennifer's body i love that movie like somewhere along that vibe like young i know i'm sexy but i'm not making effort but you know i'm acknowledging it but i'm not really putting it out there so this is what i imagine with this fragrance but that gone girl scene that's number one for this fragrance so this fragrance is juicy couture gold couture someone very young and sexy but you know not really making such of an effort to be sexy not your textbook kind of sexy but they are like secretly so yeah that's juicy gold couture so for this one you guys already know maybe the notes in here this is like a bunch of caramel and berries in here this is just delicious this is very young i know but i just love this fragrance this is actually my backup bottle because i have a smaller one I can't stop smelling it and when I spray it, it just makes me feel something. This is very sexy. This is Juicy Couture Gold Couture. Very young, very flirty, very sexy, but not, you know, that kind of thing. So yeah, that's Juicy Couture Gold Couture. This third fragrance that I have right here is like a more laid back, more mysterious kind of sexy. This one is like your messy hair, glasses, my coffee, don't disturb me. 
but you know she's really sexy and mysterious or nerdy kind of sexy and you're just minding your own business kind of and then comes this hot guy looking at you from the other table and then he comes along and is like is this seat taken so you know that kind of thing it's like oh my god seriously so yeah that's your kind of sexy for this one like coffee house like coffee beans dark sexy mysterious like i'm talking to you you know we're getting to know each other but seriously you know i want to do something else so this is our third fragrance you're very dark mysterious but really really sexy fragrance you know like <sighs> this is hugo boss private accord for her so, you know, smelling this one and putting yourself in that scenario, I mean, you can just really imagine the coffee in the air, the coffee that you're drinking and the chocolates that you're having, you know, just minding your own business, reading your book. And then here comes this hot guy, you know, like, can I sit with you? And it's like, oh, yes. So yeah, that's the kind of sexy that I imagine with this one. That's the third one. This is like a very mysterious, like, I don't know, but you know, very sexy kind of fragrance. That's Hugo Boss Private Accord for her. The fourth fragrance that I have, I imagine a corporate woman, someone who just gotten off from work. You know, I was so busy today being a boss woman. I just want to relax. I want to have myself a drink. She's not your very dark or closed up kind of woman. She's like light, confident, strong. Don't mess with her, but she is willing to play if you push the right buttons kind of so that's what i imagine with this one so what we have is jean paul gautier's label i really love this fragrance so much it's one of my favorites this has your pear your vetiver and your vanilla so it has that right mixture of sweetness tart but also your woody masculine kind of feel this is super sexy the bottle looks super chic it has your the bottle looks super chic it has those flowers in there but that's the image i kind of imagine with this one like a confident working woman it's open she's confident she's strong so you have to say the right words to her so oh, i love this this that kind of sexy you know you're in the bar you just want your alone time and someone just sits beside you you know orders another drink for you or starts talking and he luckily is a very handsome corporate man as well with this white shirt and buttons rolled up like up to his arm. This is the one, La Belle by Jean Paul Gaultier. Last but not the least, sexy fragrance that I have. I mean, looking at this, all you can just imagine is sex, sexy, yes, woman, party, sweat. And I'm talking about Jean Paul Gaultier's Scandal. Let's just have a moment and appreciate this bottle you guys this is amazing so this is like your sweet sexy confident yes i'm ready to party kind of fragrance if you're in the bar or you're in the club or wherever it is that you go to party and you're wearing your sexy dress you know short have your heels on and you're just sweaty from all the dancing and you're having drinks and you just have this on super super sexy this one has lots of honey in it it's dosed in honey super sweet very warm sexy enticing and it has your blood orange it has your peach and it has your orange blossom it also has your caramel in there so as it dries down it melts in your skin and you're sweating you're partying you're dancing get your caramel in there and you're just simply sexy and edible this is your essentially like you're ready to party ready to play kind of fragrance i would imagine a little woman together with her girlfriends you know partying and just you know ready to play just ready to mingle so this is that kind of scent if you guys have seen the movie girl strip on netflix it's jada pinkett you have tiffany haddish you have queen latifah and regina hall that's the kind of like party sexy kind of fragrance that i have with this one i mean the bottle says it all the legs the name super sexy fragrance this is just your all-around sexy sex in a bottle fragrance so this is jean paul gautier's scandal i am sweating right now and i know it's not just the heat so that's it for our five sexy fragrances with five different scenarios so you guys can just make up in your mind your own versions but those are just like my kinds of sexy my kind of sexy scenarios like the images that i have in my mind so we have our beach tropical messy hair maxi dress with a long slit that is our rebel fleur by rihanna we have our young secretly deeply sexy kind of fragrance that's in juicy couture gold couture and then we have our coffee house scene 
your coffee and your chocolate, you reading a book, and then a sexy man comes along and sits with you. So that is our Hugo Boss a private accord for her. Fourth one, we have our confident boss woman, working woman, just wants to have a night off, having her drink. That kind of sexy that's in La Belle by Jean-Paul Gaultier. And the last one, but not the least, the super sweet, enticing, sensual fragrance is just screams sexy. That is in Scandal by Jean-Paul Gaultier. So that's it for today's video, you guys. Let me know down in the comment section what your sexiest fragrance are in your collection and what's your most favorite. And of course, don't forget to click the like button if you like today's video. And if you're not subscribed yet to my channel, please do. I try to put out a couple of videos every week. And when you do, don't forget to click the notification bell since it lets you know every time I put out new content. Thank you for watching, you guys. Stay safe, have fun, much love, and see you on the next one.